you have any ideas? Ideas for what? Cool a little bit. No. Oh. Just, that's I guess. Okay. Usually when we do stuff like this, I just put that in. Oh, uh, okay. Hey everybody, hey guys, I'm well, Bat Tracy. Hey guys, I'm Stan here. And I'm Bat Tracy. For Punk Dog Blues. It's Loved Again number two. Uh, Electric Boogaloo. Yeah. Uh, because we got another month of <laughs> Loved Again media. Because the first box was okay. And this one's even better. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we got... Um, I just realized something, but I'll look at that there. The second, second box here from Loved Again media. You can see my name on it right there. I cross off the address always. Except Wisconsin, because you... You guys know which we're from. It's Kansas. You can technically even put the city. I you know. I don't like saying the city. Okay. It's a small city. <laughs> well, it's actually pretty big. Yeah. So from Love to Get Media again, we got ten Blu-rays again, and uh, we're just gonna go through them. Yeah. Real we quick. Do not remember how we did this last time. I think it's mostly just like how I'm just... doing it right now. Okay. <laughs> um. Well, so we got ten. Five of them we already owned. Okay. Um. Do they not fit in three? the box? No, they do. But they're like they're, they're space. Oh yeah. It's because of the paper, usually. Oh, okay. Um, there's three we didn't own at all, and then two are upgrades from DVD. Okay. So, so one we already owned, Wally. That was the one that came. That's pretty good. The case is really dirty, but good movie. And a good, it's a Disney one. So. It's a good get. It's a good get. Next is The Kids Are All Right. I was going to say with, I believe, Mark Ruffalo, and it's got him and that Bennett and it's a great Julianne movie. Moore. I got Mom and Dad to watch that, actually. Oh, yeah? Yeah, okay, so all movies, all of these have been good so far. <laughs> Shrek 2! The first, the second, the first second Shrek. This is the first sequel to Shrek they ever made. Yeah? Yeah. And it's a really good one. A lot of these I noticed are the, uh, they're maybe Canada. Uh, the Canadian version, because they're mm. French and English. Mm. So that's the thing they have to do in Canada. Yeah. I think I've mentioned that before. Yeah. Shrek 2, great movie. Hunger Games, A Lot of Disappointment or whatever. Is that yeah. what it's called? <laughs> and, um... Dinner for Schmucks is Le Diner des Cons. Oh, uh, yeah. This is also, uh, in French, Pitch Perfect 2. Another great Le movie. Note parfait. It's the best Pitch parfait, Perfect. I don't know how to pronounce them. And then one we already own, um, I got from Dollar Tree, but I haven't watched it because it's going to be sad. It's still Alice, with Julianne Moore, and Kristen Stewart, and Alec Baldwin. It's about a mom that gets Alzheimer's. Oh. Yeah. I'm like, oh, that's going to be sad. I don't want to watch that right now. Mm. So I just haven't watched it. Next up is Million Dollar Arm with John Hamm. I thought this came out way before the John Hamm what, being good. What do you think this movie cover looks like? It looks like a radio a little bit. It looks I think, like Invincible a little bit. Is that the Mark Wahlberg? That's the Mark Wahlberg one. I it think it like looks like The any, Rookie. Hold on. Sure. <laughs> and they're both by Disney. Yeah. Uh, next, um, a movie that I'd never heard of, but look at the cast. It's Morning Glory. It's Rachel McAdams, Harrison Ford, Diane Keaton, and Patrick Wilson, who's not big enough to get credited. Um, and it's from the writer of Devil Wears Prada, which I've seen. Have you ever seen that? Yeah. Good movie. It's all right. Devil Wears Prada's a good movie. Um, but yeah, I'm actually interested in seeing this. It looks like a romantic comedy with Harrison Ford, which, what? Mm. Is he gonna fall in love? I see have to see He's have grumpy. To. Yeah. <laughs> Next up is the five-year engagement. I was gonna say again with uh, Jason Siegel. Uh, who's that? Who's that? That's um, Udette Usman, maybe. Oh, okay. I just know Chris Pratt, and Jason Siegel from the cover. That's Emily Emily Blunt. Oh, is it? Allison Brie. You're gonna woof. I know it. There it is. And that's an upgrade from DVD. Oh. And next up, nope. A movie I'd never heard of, and it looks like another romantic thing. And it's got um, nobody I know in it except one person. It's Letters to Juliet, a song. What's that song about? Letters to Juliet. Letters to Cleo. I don't know. <laughs> I'm thinking of maybe a letter from... A letter from someone. I can't remember the name. But it's by Chiodos. Oh, okay. It's also that one song, Check Yes, Juliet, Are yeah. You With Me? It's a great song. That's the one I was going to say. Um, but yeah, it's got Amanda Seyfried, who, uh, I quite like Amanda Seyfried. Mamma Mia. Here we go again. It's a classic Hollywood love story. La La La. I'll never see that. Who? Nope. Looks bad. It's got Ryan Gosling in it. He's your boy. And, uh, the other guy. I don't like Ryan Gosling that much. Yeah, you do. What have I seen him in? Lars and the Real Girl. You always talk about how hot Ryan Gosling is. Yeah, he's very attractive, but I don't think... I haven't seen a lot with him. Oh. Uh, you're a big fan. And I 
I also think he's a poor man's version of Jake Gyllenhaal. If I don't. Being honest. I don't really like Emma Stone. You know Emma Stone. She like goes to. Um, what city is that? Monroe, right? Is that where Ross is from? Yeah, I think so. Cause and last up is a great movie. You uh, just watched this. It's an upgrade this. from DVD. You just rewatched this and loved it. Yeah, I'd give it four out of five. Yeah, it's really good. It's Meet the Robinsons. I just gave it a rewatch when Disney Plus came out. They all hate it. They all hate it. Hey, Gabe. Hey, Gabe. You want to hang out at your school? They all hate it. Hey, Gabe. Nice, <laughs> nice shirt. You want to hang out at your school? They all hate it. It's my favorite line in the movie. <laughs> I bare head and little arms. That's one of my. That's favorite. like an iconic that was in the scene. Yeah. Everyone also, at school a song to... that's not in the movie very much, but was made for it. We're living in the year three thousand, yeah. and I think it's just because Nick Jonas is the voice of Wilbur, yeah. or whatever Jonas is. Is it? Does it say the cast? It does not. I didn't know he was one. Uh, I'm Iman pretty sure he's had the never voice seen of, of this. Never heard it. I sent her the dinosaur scene. She's like, "What's that?" I was like, "Meet the Robinsons, the most famous animated dinosaur of our childhood." I remember. Um, and she's like, "No, that never happened." I was like, yeah, everyone at school used to talk about this. That movie. was Griffin's favorite Disney movie. Yeah, it's really yeah. good. I didn't think it was that good. I rewatched it because it looks cheap. It looks really bad. Yeah, yeah. but it's really good. Yeah, it's it's really good. funny. I'll have to watch that with Iman. Two times Every in a year. So Never um, thought I'd watch Meet the Robinsons twice in a year. <laughs> twice in the calendar year. Well, uh, that's all. Yeah. So, well, that's everything we got in the box. It is now just it's empty. Box. And, um, yeah. So, like I think we said in the last one, if you're interested in subscribing to this at all, you can go to lovedagainmedia.com. Yeah. Link in the description. So we're not check them out. Just go check them out. Yeah, it's just, just a fun thing. And since the first video, they've added a one-time purchase of Blu-rays only oh, now. They watch so, stars. Yeah, because I even emailed them about uh, that. And it was like, do you have that? And they're like, no, not yet. And then, they, uh, yeah, they added it right after a video came out. So... <laughs> They're big, fans. They're big fans. Maybe by next maybe next time we'll be sponsored. <laughs> hey, see your video. <laughs> Great. Like this video and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Woo. This is the outro's part for the outro. It's time we do the outro. She's woofing. This video give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. It really helps the channel out a lot. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos and hit that notification bell so you get us all the time for you know us change your mind. You can follow me at Bad Tracy on Instagram and Twitter. And Stardust. And I've been Lex Lock. You can follow me on Instagram at StrayJTheaster and on Twitter at IdiotDoll. And if you want to follow the channel as a collective, you can at Punk Rock Blues on Instagram and Twitter. And you can push to our Patreon at patreon.com slash punkrockblues. Where you can check us a buck or two or 32 to cover the cost of this box. Yeah. Is that how much it is? Yeah. Buy us a box of Love But I'll get media. some money back. Or cause... buy yourself a box of Love to Get Media. <laughs> you decide. We'll see you next no, time. Bye-bye. Uh...